It is now 4.30 and the 2017 Milwaukee Film Festival opens tomorrow night. There are 297 films that will be screened during the 15-day festival. And here's a look at a few of them, including a documentary called The Blood is at the Doorstep. It follows Dontre Hamilton's family. Dontre was a person who didn't deserve to die who didn't deserve to be shot 14 times. The blood is at the doorstep follows Dontre Hamilton's family's search for justice after a Milwaukee police officer shot and killed Hamilton in downtown Milwaukee in 2014. The film itself looks at that incident, how the justice system treated this incident, but really puts a spotlight on the family. Milwaukee Film Festival Executive Director Jonathan Jackson says it's one of the spotlight presentations. It will be shown at the Oriental Theater and the Hamilton family will speak to the audience after the screening. You have to get tough, Claire. Go with your instinct. My instinct is to quit this job run away and go home. Michael Serra stars in Person to Person. It's one of six films featured in the festival's new program called American Independence. This one's set in New York and it sort of runs to its own beat and it's a very funny film. Nothing is original. In the competition lineup, Kate Blanchett stars in a film called Manifesto. She literally plays 14 different characters in the film, reads and translate different artistic manifestos over time. You and I should uh, get together sometime and have a drink. One big name actor who is coming, Lorenz Tate, who is coming for the 20th anniversary of a screening of Love Jones. Tate is among the 100 plus actors and filmmakers who are coming to speak to festival goers. Saving something for later. So Jackson says Love Jones is virtually a sellout, so if you haven't gotten your tickets, you may be out of luck. But with almost 300 films, there are plenty more for you to see. Just go to mkefilm.org for the full lineup.